Hello, hello everyone, welcome. I want to do a quick flip through with you. This is Afternoon Tea by Teresa Goodrich. This is her book that just came out on the 15th. Um, here is the back side, so 31 beautiful illustrations, cozy kitchen scenes, elegant garden parties, charming lakeside picnics, decorative teacups, teapots, and tea settings. It's a very cute book. I was very excited. This is one of the books I was really, really looking forward to. I haven't done a full look through, so we will do that together. This one kind of gives me an Alice in Wonderland theme. I don't know why. I don't know if it's the cards with the little stopwatch or what, but there is her colored version. Now, I know there is a lot of flip throughs of this book up, being that it is a new release, but I do color, do a lot of color alongs of Teresa's book, so I also always like to have a flip up just in case somewhere down the road someone wants to see one. I have a flip through before I colored in it. So if you are not familiar, they are perforated, single sided. I think all these ones, yep, have borders around them. Always time for tea. This is a cute one too. There are quite a few in here I have my eye on. I really like these ones with flowers. I really like to do a nice white teapot with some gold accents with maybe like some blue flowers or something. I haven't decided where to start yet. Happiness is a cup of tea. Tea and pastries. Sips and sweets, that's a cute name for a shop. Pages are sticking together a little bit. Again, I have not peeked all the way through this book, so it's kind of a first look for me too. This is beautiful. A little kitty hiding up here. Very pretty. There's some more of the pastries. Nice fireplace scene. So some are a little less intricate and busy, and some are on the busier side. This one I really like too. Strawberry lemonade. Let's party. This is another one I think would be cute in a nice uh, pink theme, baby pink, soft pink, pastel theme. There's another little kitty sleeping all cute. I have my eye on this one as well. Might be a fun one to do for Valentine's. A little picnic with some tea, sitting by a lake watching the ducks swim. different kinds of tea, which I thought was neat. We got lemon and mint, chamomile, wild berries, lavender, rose. It's very neat. I do like that one. This one is pretty as well. I tend to like the ones with water. I'm not sure why, but 
Oh, here's another one with some weeping willow trees. That's what we call them here. I'm not sure what their real name is, but little lily pads and things. Very pretty. I don't know about you, but I could never leave a cup like that with my cat. She would have it knocked over, feet in it, spill everywhere. My book would be ruined, my blanket. So this is the one I was talking about on front that kind of reminds me of Alice in Wonderland. And I don't know if that's what she was going for or if it just happens to be um, the way I associate things with Alice. But we got the little stopwatch here with the key and then the cards, themed cups. Do your red rose. I don't know if I'll color mine Alice themed or not, but I do like this one. I like this one as well. So there's at least two teacups in here full of very pretty flowers. The other one was the first page in the book. I do have my eye on one of these as well. Very pretty. So we got a couple kitties in this one. Here's our little flowers and drinks over here. Now my book is already kind of starting to tear and fall apart, which is kind of a bummer. That is not on Teresa, that's just just the book, but I do like to leave the pages in my book, so it does bug me a little bit because I don't want to put all the work into coloring one and it fall out. Yeah, it's splitting all the way up. Look how high that one goes. Keep calm and drink tea. <clears throat> oh, yep. Yeah. Might be taping this one. This is another very cute one. Um, this kind of reminds me of the Christmas scene I colored last year. There was a Christmas tree on the beach with this umbrella and these cute little chairs kind of like that. So I do like that one as well. Here, doing a little cheer. And a cute little picnic. Lots of cute little couple scenes in this book. <clears throat> and get ready to party. I think we've seen that quote in here already once before. And that is our last one. So there is one of the porch scenes colored. Let me get the glare off it. So yeah, very cute book. I was expecting a little more of kind of like these kind of pages and the like actual little tea set set up kind of like these ones, but this maybe, but still very cute, still very happy with it. Like this, this is what I was expecting kind of more of. But still very cute, still, still plan on tackling it. I was looking real quick because I wanted to see. I thought I seen that part T one in here. I wanted to see how different they were. Oh. So same quote, but the pages are completely different. This one is very cute. It's on a plaque and this one's more just kind of a so yeah, so that is Afternoon Tea, Creative Haven by Teresa Goodrich. Questions, comments, requests, anything like that, let me know. And I hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.